Hi everybody, I am back. Okay, we are continuing to go through this Disney memorabilia bin that I've had in my closet for years. I've been a 30 year cast member, so um, sometimes things just got thrown in this bin. I don't even know what all is in here, so I've just been kind of emptying it little by little. This, If you haven't seen the other videos, there are a couple of other videos that I, I have done with what's been in this bin. So we're gonna continue unboxing. And if you have any comments or questions, please let me know what they are. And um, yeah, we'll, we'll get to it. So, all right, there's some things in bags here. So we'll go ahead and take a look at those. Okay, so this was well, kind of not Disney, but kind of. It was the Star Wars Celebration um, 5. I didn't know I went to 5. I thought I went to the other one. So anyway, 30 years of the Empire Strikes Back. So let's see what's in this bag of stuff. Okay, so we, okay. So we have different cards. This one says Ralph McGuire card Star Wars 5. Let's see what this is. Oh, conceptual art. Okay. So he is a conceptual artist or was a conceptual artist. He's no longer with us. He passed away in 2012. So um, these were cards that he did up with his, or that they had did up, done up with conceptual art. And then these are the aces and then they have that on the back. So that's kind of cool. Um, I like that. Um, looks like other collateral from that weekend, uh, which was a great weekend. I think this was, had pins on it. <clears throat> oh, Cartmundu. Cartmundu. So we have that. And then we have um, the different Legends action figure. These are photos, of course, of the action figures in their little habitat. So there's a whole, whole stack of those. That's kind of fun. I love Star Wars. I really do. Um, I think I held the record in my hometown for the amount of times someone actually saw Star Wars when it first came out back in the day. Um, so I've always been a fan. Got some. So there is that. We'll put that right there. Okay, what else we got in here? Oh, buttons. Buttons. Everywhere buttons. So we get a lot of buttons as cast members to celebrate different things going, oh, here's the Disney Fair. That's a huge one. That's big. Um, so we get them for celebrating milestones. We get them for celebrating different events. We get them for celebrating being a great citizen and keeping our environment safe. Um, there's another one. That's some Jiminy Cricket one. I love Jiminy Cricket. He's one of my alter egos. So you can ask me if you want to know my other alter egos. So this is a lot of buttons that we got throughout there. Oh, there's Hunchback. Woohoo! More environmentality buttons. So yes, I love to upcycle things. So um, environment. Mentality is really close to my heart. That was a goofy, goofy in the game character cafe. Um, oh, there's my. Oh, here's. This is cool. This is my Disney Fair collateral stuff. So, let's see. It's got my name and where I'm where I'm from. So on my name tags, you'll see two different cities. You'll see Bainbridge and you'll see Leesburg. Um, I I lived. Part of my life in Bainbridge, part of my life in Leesburg, Georgia. Um, had parents who were divorced and remarried, so I had two families I could go back and forth from. So Bainbridge was where my dad lived, Lees Leesburg was where my mom lived, so that's why I used to have two different cities on there. So yeah, there's my Puyallup Fair. Look how young she is. Wow, she was young. Um, so that was 1996. So that's kind of fun. And then radio call signs. If you're a leader at Disney, you probably have one of these on you um, pretty much all the time when you're working. So that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. Um, other than that, there's different, like I said, a lot more different buttons. This whole bag is full of buttons. So 
very cool stuff. I'm, I may post a photo and comments. Oh, National Hispanic Heritage Month back in 1999. So, so you never know what you'll find, but I may post photos of some of the buttons and things like that since there's so many of them in comments. If you want that to happen, leave me a comment. All right. So the next thing, oh, let me take Disney Fair out. Um, got a long box here. Nope, I can already tell it's a watch. So another watch. Oh, there's two watches in here. So I have, you know, my eyes are so bad. I think it's Small World. Small World one. And then I have this one, which this was an award um, for record-breaking year. So we, original artwork there for record-breaking record year for our merchandise division, which was a lot of fun. That was probably Magic Kingdom, I'm, I'm sure, um, that that was, that was there. So it's great to get all the wonderful recognitions. Um, the watches were good. I don't wear watches, but I have tons of watches. Um, but it's always great to get the recognition. And, and if you are, well, if you're anybody, you know, make somebody's day and, and give them a positive recognition somehow, whether you're a cast member or a leader or just some, a fan, you know, call somebody up today or send them a text and tell them how much you appreciate them <clears throat> because we all like that. And you know, right now, especially times are tough all over and it's kind of nice to know that somebody's thinking about you. So, um, I think it's another watch. What do you think? Let's see if I can get it open. Oh, it is. Okay, this is from 1996, I believe. Um, Merchantainment, team of the year. So from merchandise, I was on a team of the year. So again, another, another nice watch that I got. Um, and you know what? I think we're going to cut this right here at the 7 minute and 20 second mark or a little bit after. Um, we'll continue going through these, but I just don't want to make long videos. So I hope you're enjoying them. If you are, please like and share. And if you have comments or questions, please put them in the comment section and I'll get back to you. Have a great night.